Hey guys, it's me, Jessica. I am looking at Reddit today and I saw a question. Um, if you don't know what Reddit is, it's a online platform where people typically can ask questions within specific communities related to something. So in this instance, this Reddit um, is get employed. So people ask questions about the job search, you know, that they're on and are looking for answers from the community. So someone asks, do you customize your resume for each job application or do you use the same template for every job you apply to? So I'm going to answer this question because I, um, I currently work as a corporate recruiter. I've had over, so close to now 10 years um, of HR experience from training people um, to actually being an HR generalist, but the bulk of it stems in recruiting and finding talent for um, small, mid-sized, and large global companies. So with this question, I think the answer is not super straightforward. So, um, you know, you can definitely use a template that's really good um, for your resume. I would avoid using a standard template that you just get offline somewhere that looks very uh, basic because you're going to kind of look very similar to everyone else. Um, and you may have seen some of these templates out there, like they just look like, okay, everyone got the same exact template. I may put a photo in here to demonstrate, but everyone has this template and after looking at a couple, it just, everyone starts looking the same. So definitely use a template that stands out as far as the design and layout. With the layout, you wanna put your name and your contact information up top. Um, any skills that you wanna point out that's relevant to the job and you know the company's looking for from the job description, definitely put those in a way that's really easy for the recruiter to see, which is typically at the top. And then of course, any kind of certifications or education you would put at the top as well. And then obviously your most recent experience and then kind of go down for to your past experience but not surpassing two pages because then it starts to be a story recruiters are only going to take a couple seconds to look at your experience and kind of get an understanding of if you're fit for the role or not so all that to say definitely spend time building out a template but at the same time if you're applying to different types of positions you're going to want to customize your resume to match the job description that you're applying to. So for example, if I'm applying to a corporate recruiter position and job descriptions for this company and this company are pretty much the same, I can use the same resume, right? Um, however, if I'm applying to, you know, I have a training background, if I'm applying to a trainer position and then I wanna also apply for this corporate recruiting position over here, I'm going to customize my resume so I can still use the same layout, um, which is going to be easy because I know when you're on the job search, like you have time, <laughs> you need to have time to fill out these long applications and read your resume every single time. Now I would say use the same template, right? Use the same template, but customize it to the job. So instead of using keywords that are specific to a corporate recruiter, I'm going to use keywords that are specific to a trainer role and specifically call outs from the job description. So if they're saying they are, this company is looking for someone with facilitation skills or um, skills with adult learners, I'm going to call that out of my resume and make it really easy for the recruiter or whoever's looking at my resume to see I have that experience they're looking for. Um, specifically the required skills, which most job descriptions will show, and then any preferred skills that they're looking for. So any assets um, that is not required, but the company really wants. So um, I don't know if that helps, but I saw that and I was like, well, it's not white or black. <laughs> the answer to that question, do you customize a resume um, for each job application or do you use the same template? Um, for every job you apply to. It's kind of yes and no. So ultimately you wanna use the same template, um, a good template that you have found is 
you know, will work for you, is easy to understand, um, but you want to <clears throat> call out different kinds of skills or certifications or things in your experience that apply to the specific job that you are um, interested in. So you may need to take out, you know, some things in your experience that aren't really related to that job and just save a copy, you know, save the copy. Don't save it as, you know, um, anything weird. You might, you know, just save it as something you'll know it's for. So maybe say your name and then uh, the company um, that is for, <clears throat> excuse me, um, or maybe the date. Um, that's totally fine. So um, anyway, I hope this is helpful. Again, I'm Jessica. I post different videos about um, the job search and I hope that this kind of content is helpful. Let me know if it is helpful for you and also let me know if you have different thoughts on, you know, how to customize your resume for different um, jobs and then let me know if there's any topics that you are specifically interested in. All right, guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye.